I'm Stephanie and this is Snowdom of the Day. Today we have not one but two Snowdoms from Abilene. Abilene, Kansas, home of President Dwight Eisenhower. And both of the domes today are related to President Eisenhower. The first one is from the Eisenhower Center, which you will see rising up in front of the metropolis of Abilene, Kansas, which has approximately 7,000 residents. The other dome features the Eisenhower home where there are pet elephants. There are not pet elephants, but the dome does have elephants on a seesaw, a favorite thing to put inside a snow dome. There's a lot of snow as well, which is probably pretty realistic <laughs> for people who live in Kansas in the winter time. Um, so President Eisenhower uh, graduated from high school in Abilene, and um, I think that's part of why he's important to their history. I've been to Abilene a few times. It's on Interstate 70, so some people have probably been to Abilene on their way somewhere else, but I was there on purpose to visit the Greyhound Hall of Fame. They have one, and it's in Abilene, Kansas. I don't think it has a snow dome, but it's a pretty great place to go to learn more about greyhounds, and I'm pretty sure they always have a greyhound on staff as a volunteer that you can pet and talk to when you go visit. So that's one of my favorite things about Abilene. I'll also note that if you're traveling in and around Abilene, Kansas, you might want to make a list of all the thrift shops nearby because the church lady thrift shops in the area, I think, are excellent. We found a bust of Amelia Earhart, another person with Kansas ties, in nearby Russell, Kansas. So those are my stories about Abilene, Kansas. I don't know very much about Dwight Eisenhower, and I'll admit I don't really regret that, although I have many friends from Kansas who probably have learned quite a lot about him on Kansas Day, and I'm guessing they'll fill me in on important parts of that history. So, today, I give thanks for Interstate 70. It's taken me many great places. I give thanks for the church lady thrift shops and the church men who help them to staff the church lady thrift shops. I give thanks for Greyhound dogs. They're beautiful and they seem to be fairly kind. And I give thanks for the eclecticism of this world in which we live that gives us many things to ponder, to contemplate, and to think about. It's Wednesday in my world. I have figured that out several times today and I've also forgotten it several times today. I hope you're doing all right today. And if you see this today, I film it. It is indeed Wednesday. Blessings to you.